Despite their relative success in the World Cup, the England women's football team couldn't shake off one particular criticism. They were too white. The only thing I would say about this picture here, what jumps out of you is that this doesn't sort of represent diverse Britain. Um, it's all these blonde, blue-eyed girls. It's OK to be blonde-haired and blue-eyed. But I do think we need to ask ourselves questions about why is it that we've got... Um, it's so... It has but a lack of diversity. Are, they're, they're playing sport at an elite level. Yeah. And they are from Britain. And... They're, they're women. Not good enough to just be women when you're playing oppression Olympics top trumps. It doesn't make any difference. I think if the whole idea behind this is going to encourage more women to go and into the sport, you need some sort of representation yeah. there to say whatever background you come from, you could get to this sort of level. Because Britain doesn't look like that. Yeah, yeah, but it doesn't, it's, it's fashionable to knock men, but if this was a man, <laughs> it would be... I mean, who could argue with him? Indeed, racism won't end until every single Western European sports team looks like the French under-21s. Not very diverse, is it? No, that lack of diversity is OK. Don't you get it yet? If it's white, it ain't all right. These two are on borrowed time. But when it comes to the England women's team, it's significantly more diverse than the country itself. England is 4.2% black according to the latest census and the England women's football team is 13% black with three out of the 23 women in that squad ticking that box no that's not good enough this doesn't sort of represent diverse Britain meanwhile an official guide published on the London City Hall website warned against using this photograph of a young white family when promoting London Mayor Sadiq Khan or the Greater London Authority a member of Khan's staff captioned the photograph saying it doesn't represent real Londoners yes white people in England England's capital city aren't representative of real Londoners. The guidelines give advice on showing the mayor in the best light and say official photos should reflect a recognisable real and diverse London. So apparently white people existing in London isn't even being treated as real anymore. At this point, what exactly does diversity even mean? Whether you want to call it racism or anti-white prejudice, there's something deeply wrong with the, the mayor of London's office where diversity now is just a code word meaning non-white. No, you can't say that. Get early access to videos, exclusive live streams and personally DM me. You've seen how much I get demonetized all the time. Well, this is how you support me. By subscribing at pauljosephwatson.locals.com. Please click the link in the description.